With the older version of Excel, if you wanted to create a pivot chart, you had to create the pivot table first. And now you can actually just create a pivot chart on its own. So you've got pivot chart here. So you can just go to insert, choose pivot chart, and then you can say, OK, this is the data. And I'm going to put the chart on. Let's say we'll put the chart in a new worksheet. And then we can choose what we want. So we'll have category for the axes and we'll have amount for the values. And there we go. There we get our pivot chart. So it automatically creates the pivot table, but you don't have to create the pivot table first. And you can do all the things that you could do in the older version now in the chart. It's just that the chart can be created independently. And talking about charts, what you've also got on the insert menu is just like we had recommended pivot tables, we've got recommended charts. So it analyzes your data and then comes up with some suggestions as to what would be the best chart to use to effectively get the message across as to the, the type of data. Mm -hmm.